everyone. Welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today I have nail art. <laughs> um, I am using She Modern nail foils, something totally different. There's no coloring in. Really simple um, design. I completely love it. Um, in the meantime, there I have a tips and tricks and I also am going to um, pop in the description box below a link to Nails of Interest. She actually came up with a better idea to remove the foils from the um, from that protective film that they're actually attached to. So I would highly suggest you watch that. I'll be using that technique in my upcoming videos. Um, so you will see it on my channel as well. And um, thanks to Nails of Interest for that awesome idea. <laughs> so much easier, so much easier, let me tell you. But anyways, um, I do have to apologize. Part of the video is not in frame, uh, like kind of an important part. Um, I didn't remove it uh, because I want you to look at my hands. No, <laughs> I didn't remove it because um, I, I think I was talking through some things there and I I just didn't feel like chopping that part out. Um, in When I do the second nail, then you will be able to see what I did. And I'm really, really sorry about that. I just, I'm sorry. That's all I can say. And I'm sorry. And I hope you watch the video and I hope you like it anyway. Um, anyways, um, I guess I'm sorry that I haven't had so many videos. I mean, just the allergies have been so bad for me. I swear. I do not want to get up off the couch. I do not want to get out of bed. I am like dragging. I am so tired. And to try to do these videos has just been really rough. Um, my tips and tricks video took like three days to do. And it's like not usual for me. Usually I'm popping up after work and I'm doing a video and on the weekend I'm doing three and four. Um, so I'm really sorry about that, but, um, I'm starting to feel a lot better. So I think you guys are going to be doing some marathon mo um, videos. I've got a whole bunch of them that just need to be, um, whatever you call it, edited and they'll be popping up next week. Um, there'll be, let's see my, uh, organizational stuff, a tour of my desk. Um, what else? I don't know. More nail art. <laughs> um, so I hope you like it. I hope you like what's coming up. Ooh, swatches. Um, definitely a lot of swatches coming up. Um, I had like a swatch video that I just never put up from before and I'm still not going to because the lighting was off for some reason. So I think I'm just going to redo that one, but I've got some exciting, um, new swatches coming up. So I will hope you will stay tuned for those. Um, Anyways, let's get started on with this awesome idea. It's been an idea that I've had for a really long time and I've been wanting to do it and I really love how it did turn out. So, and I hope you will too. So let's get started. So today I'm going to do a fun design using um, some She Modern shapes and they're in the colors teal and pink. I'm using gel polish, so I'm using um, Wave Gel's base and shiny no clean top coat. And I have a new mood color called I'm Pink and Purple. The base has already been applied. So now I'm going to go in with the, the color. Cap the edges. I'll do that and cure it and we'll come back for the second coat. Okay, so now we're ready for the second coat. This this is an amazing formula, just like all of the other ones. It's nice and pigmented, goes on really smooth. I love it. I hope we're going to get to see it be pink because it keeps like instantly changing back as soon as I'm out of the light. Um, but I already top coated the nails that aren't going to get the um, foil art. And the foil art ones, I'm going to remove the tacky layer. Okay, so 
in with the foil art. You should all be familiar. Comes with your sheet of foil. And sticker paper. Comes with a mixing canvas and some extra foils. Let's pull this one out. This one's all squares. I like to see what the surprise I get inside. <laughs> okay. Let's pull this out. We're going to make some stickers. Okay, so I have all my shapes on here. And I'm going to be using InstaDry by Sally Hansen. So I am just going to brush a very thin coat of this to make my stickers. Over the whole design, leaving a little bit on the edge. And we should dry in about 60 seconds. That's probably why my little brush is drying out here. I'm not moving fast enough. I'm not sure this one's going to come out right. A bit more on there. Okay. So those will be dry in 60 seconds and we can put them on my fingers. Okay, so I grabbed the mixing canvas and now I'm just going to lightly push up on the edge to loosen the decal. And then I'll just do that with the rest of them and we'll come back. And I'm going to put um, a thin coat of foil art glue on the back of these. So let's stick to the nail. And when it turns white, or clear, when it turns clear, then it will be ready to go. Okay, so now I have um stamper head right here, and we're going to go ahead and put one of these Okay, so we're going to put one of these on the stamper head here <clears throat> and then just position it on my nail, push it down and it's already coming up so that is a good thing. Great. We'll get another one. 
Gonna go with a little triangle. Down there. And position it where I want on my nail. Push it down. And that's perfect. Okay, I'm just going to kind of clean up the edge that's hanging off right here. So to do that, I'm just going to take a little bit of acetone. I'm going to melt that right off. And I'm just going to blend in the edges right here. And what's on my brush is alcohol. So that the alcohol will not hurt the foil art. But it will kind of melt away and blend that um, quick dry Sally Hansen. So that's pretty cool. Then just go around the edges of my nail, make sure there's no polish. And then we're ready to put a top coat on it. Okay, so for my other finger, we're going to do the triangle. There, comes off really nice. I love how shiny that looks. And then we have the little square. There we go. So we'll take the alcohol, no, this is the acetone, <laughs> don't get the two mixed up. So we're going to take the acetone and just kind of melt away the edges here. Oh, that looks good. All right, then we're going to take the alcohol and blend it in. Okay, now we're ready for the top coat. So I got my shiny no clean top coat right here. And then I can cure that. And then we'll come right back. Okay, so here's what they look like warm. I like the color. <laughs> it's going to turn to purple pretty quick because it's kind of cold in here. So this is the finished look. I It's not cooperating. It's like half pink, half purple. doesn't know whether it wants to be warm or cold, so I just 
made these guys a little cold so you could see the color difference. I like this color. I love these shiny colored foils. They are really cool. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.